Hey everyone, it's LaShawn McQuarrie Redman bringing you another white towel video message. Today I'd like to talk to you about what you're allowing in your life. There's an old saying that we teach people how to treat us and I have found this to be entirely true that we do in fact teach people how to treat us. So the question becomes, how are you being treated? How does your spouse treat you? If you're not married, how do the people you are dating treat you? How does your mother treat you? Your coworkers, your boss, or maybe you're the boss. How do your employees or your contractor, how do people treat you? And I have to ask you this question because there's something inside of each of us. There's a way that we communicate. There's a way that we show up in life that lets people know, oh, I can run over that person. Yes, he or she is going to set boundaries, but I know how to push boundaries. I know how to get what I want. I know how to manipulate that person. I know how to control that person. And they learn these things because somewhere along the lines, you've taught those individuals how to treat you. So, if you're in a situation right now, and there's someone that's not treating you properly and you feel it, you feel disrespected, you don't feel appreciated, loved, whatever it is that you're looking for and you know that you are not being treated properly in this relationship, I want you to take a step back and then take a look at yourself and then even go deeper and take a look inside yourself and figure out what is it that you're showing this person? Why is it that they think that they can talk to you however they talk to you or they can treat you the way that they're treating you? And then I want you to make a very important decision. And that decision is that you are going to do what you need to do to make that change, to cause that shift. Because even though you can't change the person, there are things that you can say and do that will cause that person to respond to you differently. Now, of course, there's going to be a little bit of a drawback because if people have been saying whatever they want to say and treating you however they want to treat you for quite a while, there's going to be some resistance initially. But you owe it to yourself to stand up, stand your ground and make it be known that there is a certain way that you want to be treated. And yes, you may even wanna say, I should have said this before, or I should have done this a long time ago, but I didn't, that time has passed, but today is a new day. And so now I'm going to teach you a different way of responding to me. I'm going to teach you how to really treat me properly. And you don't have to say those words to the person, but you definitely need to have that conversation within yourself. Act as if you're actually having the conversation with that person so that you can help yourself follow through with that decision. So remember, whatever you're receiving in your life, you're receiving those responses from different individuals because that's how you have taught them to treat you. If you don't like the way you're being treated, then you're gonna have to go back, rework some things, and then teach them something different.